there are 20 amino acids used in proteins. A typical protein would be roughly 1,000 amino acids long. Although proteins can widely vary in their length, 1,000 amino acids is a reasonable estimate for the length of an average sized protein. The primary structure of a protein can be compared to beads on a string. The calculations that I presented in the previous video were for a protein of average length. For each bead amino acid in our string protein, we have a 1 in 20 chance of getting the right one. So, if we have 1,000 beads amino acids, and each one has to be right, then we have a 1 out of 20 times 1 out of 20 times 1 out of 20 1,000 times or 1 out of 20 to the thousandth power chance of getting all of those beads right. Like I said in the video, there are 10 to the 80th atoms in the entire universe. There have also been 9.47 times 10 to the 17th seconds in the supposed 15 billion years since the Big Bang. If we have one new lottery ticket for every atom in the entire universe every second for the supposed 15 billion years since the Big Bang, then we have 9.47 times 10 to the 97th lottery tickets. Compare this with the 1 out of 20 to the thousandth power odds of getting just one protein. And remember, hundreds are needed. See my other video for details. Experiments that have shown that amino acids could have formed naturally are not relevant here. Since the point of these calculations is not whether amino acids could form, or whether or not they could form strings. Instead, these calculations are on the odds of the amino acids of that string being in the correct order 